Well, good evening. Monkey Astronomer here. Well, it's about 6.30 p.m. on the 8th of May. Uh, I'm here 100 kilometers west of Sydney, and uh, there's going to be a pass of the International Space Station overhead in just a few minutes. So I'm going to try to uh, record that with my camera. The moon is up there. There it is. There's the moon. And the uh, space station is going to pass a few degrees above the moon, I think. I've got my uh, Sky Safari here on my iPad showing the position and you can see the ISS is just there which is um, you know, it's just below the horizon actually at the moment. It'll be coming up in, in a couple of minutes. <laughs> That's a plane. It's above the horizon now, just a couple of degrees. It's 6.34, probably in about three or four minutes. I might have a chance of seeing it. Well, I think I just spotted it, just over there below Jupiter. I think it's behind cloud at the moment. I definitely saw something star-like moving. So, oh yeah, I see it. I see it. Okay, let's see if I can catch this. It's just going past Jupiter now. Hang on. Let me switch to low light. Let me switch to manual focus. Focus, manual. Okay, so let's. Go to full. Okay, I think it's just behind cloud. Now that star-like object is Jupiter. Oh, I think it, there it is. Yeah, I see it. It's coming up above the clouds now. Yep, it's showing up. Just not sure if it's fully in focus. Yep, I think it's focused. It's quite bright. Now we'll be going close to the moon. I'll zoom in on it. There it is. Zoom out again. Okay, there's the moon. It's very high up, it's at about 70 degrees. And it's quite bright. I would say, yeah, looks like minus three, something like that. Passing by the moon, just zoom in, zoom in on the moon, see the moon there, and the space station is there, zoom in, because when I zoom in it's, it's just a, an overexposed dot. Zoom out again. Hang on. It's well past where the moon is now. It's almost directly overhead now. Oh, there's the moon again. I'm getting the moon in the picture. It's fading. I think what's happening is it's moving into the Earth's shadow. Yep, it's just disappeared. So it's uh, gone out of sunlight and into darkness. Well, there you have it. The International Space Station. Very exciting. <laughs>